I'm back. They had me hostage, bro. That was a clone the last videos. We have 1,000 baht today. This is all we have to spend. We're in the middle of nowhere. This is where they took me, bro, and I just woke up here last night. This is crazy. This is the ocean right there. We're somewhere in Krabby, Thailand. They had me on a train. But I'm back and Tanner comes today. I was supposed to go to Koh Samui with Tanner, but they got me, man, and they replaced me. But I'm back, though, man. It feels good, bro. I see all y'all's comments and support. Thank y'all, man. When I wasn't myself, y'all still had me. And now today, we're back with a banger. And it hopefully ends with Tanner eating some bugs. So, man, this place is insane, bro. Let's go check it out. I've never seen nothing like this. Look, Look at all these tree roots, dude. Like, we're in the jungle for real. Still have all of my thousand. I haven't even drank water today. I've been waiting to do this video for so long. I hope y'all enjoy it, man. Let's get back to the old van boys. The I'm scared of heights. I just came up here. I cannot do this this early in the morning. But damn, this is beautiful. I don't know if it's because I'm stoned or if I'm above the trees with water behind me, bro. But I got to go like this down these stairs. Oh, my goodness. I'm so scared of heights. Oh, please. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Oh, shit. We'll just make it through this, guy. Just please. Oh, my goodness. I made it. It's time to go spend some money. That goes way up there, like five stories, bro. My heart sank to my stomach. Boat to the cave? How much, my friend? How much money? 20? 400. 400. Oh, I'm on a budget today. Damn. I can't. I didn't even bring that much money. I can, it's okay, bro. I got it. Damn, when I looked online, it said 100 baht to go to that cave. And I know if I pull out this $1,000 bill, he ain't going to take less than 300. <laughs> he ain't going to take less than 400. So it ain't, and I ain't even going to go over there. It's literally right across the creek. He's trying to charge me $12 for there and back, which I understand. But I'm on a budget today. This is the 1000 I have to spend all day long. I'm not going to start my 9 o'clock in the morning with spending a third of my budget. You gotta be smart in Thailand, man. You can't let them people like talk you into things. Like if I don't wanna do it, I don't have to do it. You know, I feel like some people get pressured into it. As a tourist, man, you have to like not be rude though. I wasn't rude. I just stood on business, you know? A thousand dollars is about $30 US. And I definitely know I can live on that in one day. I'm about to show y'all probably less than this. First purchase of the day, you gotta get the necessities. Seven, nine, five. I got it in my room. I got more watermelon now. <laughs> Boom, there's 100 baht or $3 spent on just appetizer for breakfast. Now I gotta get the main course. I know the rule every time you pass the coconut ice cream, man, you have to get a bowl. 20 baht gone before breakfast again. <laughs> I told myself I was gonna budget and not be fat, but here I am eating bre ice cream for breakfast. <laughs> Got some duck and chicken right here. Check out the menu. 60 baht. I just got some teriyaki chicken and rice soup. Oh man. I knew it wasn't. It's freezing cold, man. Some of these food places don't cook it fresh. I don't know why. What the, f the places with the food, the meat hanging in the window like that. As a person who's been here for four months, I recommend you not to go there. As soon as I ordered the food, she brought my plate out that fast. The chicken was cold like she cooked it this morning. I guess if you're on in a hurry, it's a good place to go. It wasn't bad chicken. I ate it all still. Just a tip. I knew better and I still went, but it is what it is. I enjoyed it. Tanner left his phone in a grab on Koh Samui and the police like those right there are said they're gonna find it, bro. America would never. They would say, oh, screw you. You lost your phone. Oh, go cry about it. In Thailand, bro, they were confident they're about to track that phone down and find it. They told them, don't even leave the police station. Woo! Reason number 69 why Thailand is better than the United States, man. I love it here, man. They care about you, even if you're a foreigner. Oh, hell no, nah, bro. That's an alligator. What the hell is this, man? Y'all see that? I just swam away. Oh, hell no. Nah. Somebody comment what that was. That was a baby alligator, a snake, a big anaconda snake. 
Oh, $20 hotel with central air. Like these $20 hotels are very nice. It's when you want to save even more money and book a $10 room where things get a little sketchy. <laughs> I got to take a motorbike to the famous Isle Name Beach. It's 150 baht. So now it's at 330 baht. It's only 12 o'clock. Hopefully I can make it today on this budget. Those mountains surrounding you is so insane. Man. Look at this place. Dang, I'm oh, smoking. This place is so insane. I love Krabby Thailand. Thank you, my friends. See you for the ride. Here we are. It's the Ain't It Ben's house. I'm just gonna ignore that bottom sign. It's uh, somebody's guest house. The man named Ben, it's his guest house. Normally the guest houses are a lot smaller and like better quality than the hotels. So, and this is right by the beach for $20. That's the pool down there. Oh. Yeah, this is gonna be sick. Shoes off at the front. Let's check her out. So I can't check in till two, but I can check out the pool, man. Look at this. Cheers. I go live on YouTube every single day now. I'm basically a streamer. All right, let's check out this room. Damn, it's super huge in here and very cold off the rip huge nice bathroom look at this bro i didn't even ask for this separate bed just one king size bed and look at the balcony for twenty dollars and the famous Aonang beach is literally one mile away like like 15 minute walk this place is a steal if you're coming to Krabby thailand and you're going to the famous Aonang beach with a, which of course you are bro definitely book ben's guest house for twenty dollars wow Look at this place. I caved in and got grabbed instead of went out and got seafood. I'll do that later. We got some fire though. I hope this is mine. Got some fire. Let's go check this out at the hotel. Had to chase her ass down before somebody got my food, dude. I'm in barefoot out here, man. She was driving away from the hotel, dude. I guess she was confused. I seen her, I started hawking. This place is in the cut. You gotta go all the way up here and around the corner, but bro, this is one of the nicest places I've stayed in, I promise you. I just spent 290 on this food, so that brings our total of the day to 620 baht. Uh-oh, I'm definitely not getting a massage. I only have 280 baht left, and it's three o'clock. Uh, I hope this food does the spot. Let's go check it out, man. Goodness. I had my toe on so many things in Thailand. There's so many little ledges. Oh, it's never bleeds though. It's okay. Everything's okay. Every little thing. Let's see what we got. I'm too stoned. I forgot. Some type of soup. Oh, cashew fried chicken. That's why I got this rice right here. Rice, you could always order it for like 15 baht, like literally 50 cents, and you can just get whatever you want. It don't come with rice though, so make sure you order the rice extra. Damn, that's gonna be the meat and bones. Let's see what this is. I have a feeling I know chicken wings! And they know me. I forgot to tell them to put chicken this sauce wing, in there. Chicken wing. They just know me. Wow, thank you. I don't even know what place this is, but it. They're kind of soggy chicken wings though. I don't know about these, but they're gonna be fire. But these, normally they're not soggy. Mmm. Mmm. Both of these were four to like a dollar fifty. I mean, um, 150 baht. Damn, I'm fried. 150 baht, which is like five dollars. Damn, they're normally way cheaper, but we are next to the beach. They have a sale on Grab for a lot of restaurants, like five different restaurants. 
and you, if you spend 150 baht, you save 50. So I got 50 baht off this restaurant. Oh, let's taste this on. Oh yeah, this is it right here. This is what y'all all been waiting for back home. Something different. And let me tell you, this is it, honey. Can y'all see that right there? Like, I just want you to get a good look at that, cause I'm about to eat it all. Like, that's so healthy. It's cash, cashew fried chicken. Like, you get this at your local uh, Chinese restaurant, you can get something like this, but it's not gonna be like this, you know. Mmm, hot as shit. Why is it hot as shit? Mmm. Wow. It's just natural. Everything in that bowl is no preservatives, no steroids. Same as this chicken. That's why this wing is so damn small. No preservatives, no steroids. Ooh, put that sweet chili on it. Oh, that is better than making love. Mm. It's most likely going to get spit on food. That's what I'll be doing all day, every day. Is this like a food review channel? Man, let's go hit the beach, bro. That's what I'm about to do, and it's free to do that. So they got a night market there. I'm about to edit this video, and I'll see y'all. I just throw the rice in there, mix her up. Like, bro, that is fire. Talk about bulking and having meal prep. Man, you can have other people make your meals fresh for you in a little meal prep jar, have it delivered to your house. Man, this place is just crazy, bro. Chicken wing, chicken wing. I'm in love with Thailand. Hey. Hey, it's no edit. That's the music they're playing. We're back on crab. Look how nice these places are. Hey, it's back on our doorstep. Hey, I'm about to come back. <laughs> Damn. Whoa, we made it. We made it. But you can walk all the way out where the people are. Like, I guess it's just no ocean. Got a little dog on the beach here, but this is magical, bro. Look at this place. What are they feeding these European women too, bro? I don't know about her, but I've been seeing them. They wear the, like the white pants and like the shirts with no bras, bro. They're so fine. European women might be the sexiest women. I'm not gonna lie. Look at all them people. That's the beach. Normally the water is way up here, but the tide is way like a mile that way. Damn, still same beautiful sunset. I'm about to walk over there. This is where I stepped on that sea urchin. All the boats are normally pulled up here. Isn't that crazy to y'all? How the shore is one mile that way? When What? That makes sense to me. Still dope though, the sunset is crazy beautiful. Dang, this sunset's about to go. <laughs> this is wild. The sun is set, now it's time to go hit that night market and spend these last monies and get some dinner in. Boy, I just woke up from a cush nap. Woo! I love Thailand, baby. Dang, this just doesn't look real, does it, man? With the sun setting right behind the beach. The Ao Nang Beach, bro. Let's go check out this night market here. We made it, amigos. This is the fanciest night market in Thailand. Look at this place, bro. We got some beautiful women this way. I'll swing by. Like, look at them, man. They look like from a whole different country. Look at this night market, though. So nice and clean. Oh, I got 280 baht. 280, sounds like a lot, but it's not that much. We're working with about a little less than $9, and I'm a fat, hungry boy. So we have to be wise with what we get. Damn, whoa. I'm seeing some solid choices right here. Sarika! <laughs> This is my favorite though, seafood grill. I've had it for the last three nights in a row. A different one. Ah, garlic bread. 
I've learned the fresh seafood is in the south, obviously by the oceans. Up north, you can't really find seafood and it's expensive and it's not fresh, it's frozen. So take advantage of the cheap, take advantage of the cheap seafood while you're in the south. Look at these beautiful fish, man. It don't get much fresher than that. They were caught this week. They might've been caught yesterday, man. They don't even look like they've been frozen before. And it tastes amazing, man. Three nights in a row, you think I wouldn't get tired of it? I picked the cheapest red snapper and they got to cooking. Bro, does that not look amazing? Oh, that's a chicken? I thought that was a turkey. I'm fried. What? Mango, how much? 50 baht. 60. Damn, I have 20 baht left to spend at 7-Eleven. In your opinion, was today's $30 worth it? Or did I waste it? Or did I get ripped off? What do y'all think, man? Let's see how this fish comes out. When a place only sells fruit, you know their smoothies are gonna be fire. We got cilantro and the watermelon. He's giving me a slice of lime on it. Oh, it comes with a mango. Best shake ever. Oh yeah, fire. Hey, that's how they cut the mango so you can eat it. Comes with it. Thank you so much. Well, they said I couldn't do it, and I did it, man. That's what the. That's what. It don't matter if they say you can't do it. It don't matter if they hate it on you for your last couple videos. As long as you do it for this one, man, is all that matters. On somebody took my chair, but it's okay, man. I'm gonna find a new one. Friend, thank you, yes sir. I will enjoy. Oh, it's some of the best grilled food right at this night market. That's his seafood grill right there, bro. He's a G. He's a legend. Let's try this out. Put that flash on. Look how he does it, dude. Peels the skin back for you. This sauce is a little spicy, but fire. Oh, yeah. Bye-bye, fishy. <laughs> it's time to dig in. Oh, my God. Goodness, this just came off the grill. This is as fresh as it gets right here on the beach. My mouth is salivating over this shit. The best fish I've had in these last couple days, dude. It's really fresh. Oh, see the saliva coming from my mouth? See y'all. I finished that fish. That's three days in a row I've ate seafood. But now, let's go back, see what the night is. See what this nightlife's looking like. Thank you. I think I went over my budget, but when you pass this, you have to grab one. <laughs> you see it picked up. It's so hot in between these markets from all the people cooking and probably from all the body heat. It is packed. Damn. Cheers. Look what they got going on here. All these people can just get some live music. Damn, she's fine as hell right there in front. Thank you. Request for the Thai sauce. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> he said thank you. <laughs> Damn, I thought I was gonna be able to. I really do need some more elephant clothes. It would suck if I went above my budget. I, I think I should stick to it. It's all girls' clothing. Shirt for 150. Would y'all buy any of this elephant clothes? Let me know. I love these pants. These are girl version, but. Sick. Isn't it cool like every day they have these markets to go to at night? Like we don't have nothing like this in America. Where's our culture? Just drinking beer, man. Drinking beer and watching sports games. <laughs> this fancy restaurant on the beach with the surfboards. Very nice and elegant. And right next door you got the cheaper option if you don't want to spend that much money. What a way to end the day the good old 7-Eleven, baby. About to grab some water and that's the day in Thailand under $30. I could have went under 500 baht, $15 if I really tried. I was getting expensive food. We had the long bike ride, but I had a good day and ate good for the bro. All of them, just that fish at the end would have cost $30 in America. To think that I, I did all day on 30, man, I love Thailand. It's a nice little walkway to the city. It's how you get here. All the hotels are most likely over there. And the beach is behind me. You know you're on the right path if it smells like shit. I don't know why, but it must be like some sewage right here. But something. But it definitely smells like a sewage plant. It's just endless beach shops. You see, you got places you can get a massage. You can go on a tour. 
This restaurant looks super sick, dude. Damn, expensive, super expensive. I better get away. Man, thank y'all so much. When I wasn't myself, that was like a metaphor at the beginning. I wasn't acting myself and the comments helped me pull through, man. I was selling out for the views because uh, instead of making the content that, that I enjoy making, that's what, and I wasn't sleeping good. I just got two nights in a row finally after like 10 days of without sleeping a full seven, eight hours like I normally do. So it feels, that feels good. And, and I was making videos for the YouTube algorithm instead of just going to beautiful places like this, which is why I came to Thailand for, and mushroom shakes and exploring, and look at these trees, bro. Are you kidding me? Wow, bro, this is insane. This used to be filled with water, and now there's like no water. Look at those little spiky things on the ground. Like those are those, what is that? Trees growing? Underground trees? Like what the hell is that? This is insane though, bro. Like this is why, this is why I came to Thailand. And I just want to thank y'all for when I wasn't remembering why. I was, I was like, I was lost, but I was just foggy on the sleep, but I was so lost in making content, I just needed a break really, but instead of taking a break, I was posting and the videos I wasn't proud of, so it was making me not want to post, like, I don't know, it was just a bad feeling. It was, it's, if you're a content creator or you want to be, it's supposed to flow naturally, you're supposed to do what you love doing, like, man, mm. That's what I love doing, man. I'd rather kiss trees than these bar girls, man. But if you watch the end of those videos, I never went through with anything because it always didn't feel right in my gut. Which this feels right in my gut. So make the content that feels right, not what the YouTube algorithm promotes more. That's what I was doing. And, and uh, shit, we grew the page though. We're at 17,000. This is a dream come true. When we hit 20,000, I own like, I, that's when I know it's really about to go crazy. I'm just trying to get to 20,000 and it's slow grind is the best grind, man. You're not supposed to rush anything in life, especially not success. So I got to just keep my head down until I come up. Don't take the easy way out. I don't want those type of viewers anyway. I want y'all OG. I got to cater to the OGs, the people who been watching my page. That's the type of people I want on here. I don't want these new people that just want to see the, the girl stuff because I don't even like making those videos. But uh, yeah, it's a learning progress, man. Y'all can't fault me on one or two videos when I've, bro, I've been doing this for almost like four months straight. Content every single day, damn near. And uh, just had to switch it up, but I should only done it for like one video and then went back to my normal stuff. You know, like it's good to switch things up. Feels good to be back at least though, man. This walkway goes on forever. I've just been recording and talking and this shit just keeps going. Feels so freeing being in a place like this, man. Rather than being around all them club lights and uh, just unnatural stuff and then walking through this, it's a totally different feeling, man. Damn, it's a person up here. Fried as a pickle bubby in the southern United States. They probably do fried pickles everywhere. But I'm one of them right now. And I'm about to link up. Bro, it's that Thai stuff. It's that Thai stuff, bro, for the $2. For, uh, we're, we're gonna have, we'll talk about that another day on the live stream. I'm about to go live with Jonathan, though. Uh, he watches the videos, he flew out to Thailand, and he's been talking about linking up for a while. I didn't even know he was going to be in Krabby at the same time. I told him we was, but I guess I just manifested, and here we are, and now we're about to smoke up on uh, on live. So cheers to that, and uh, love all the support, man. Give me some good comments and likes, bro. Let's, let's, bro, let's do this, bro. Let's get to 20K and then 100K, and let's grow Tanner's page. Let's grow Canada's page, and... Let's do this, bro. God, look at this hotel room, bro. It's only up from here, man. $20 can get you so much in Thailand. I just showed y'all what $30 can get you all day long. Tell me in the comments what other type of videos like this you want to see. Give me ideas. Come on now. Y'all are the chosen ones that found me before shit started taking off. So I need y'all's help. 
in a lot of different ways I need your help. So give me some ideas, give me some likes, give me some support, so many different options to help me. And uh, cheers, bro. I'm about to go live with Jonathan though, bro. So hopefully you make that. Damn, this hotel room's AC is so good, man. It's freezing in here. Oh, dude, am I the only one, bro? I sleep with it so cold. I feel like that's just how you sleep better. Bro, my hair has been, I just get, so, I've been so healthy ever since Thailand, bro. I cannot be grateful enough for this country. Tanner lost his phone 24 hours later. I said, hey, my YouTube comments said, go to the police station. They will help you. Goes to the police station with Canada. The police have his phone within 30 minutes, bro. I hope, I think that's what he told me at least. I don't, I, I guess I haven't talked to him since he actually got it, but uh, he was supposed to get his phone back and that's just such a miracle, man. Thailand's such a magical place. Like this country, America, they would have laughed in your face, man. And, and like, man, they would have made fun of you. Thailand, they're here to help apparently. So my all my experience has been good, 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 great, 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 excellent, amazing, and I love this country, and I can't wait to show y'all more of it, and we have so much more up north to explore. This is down south still, like, man, we have song crack coming up, the Thailand New Year's with water gun fights, like, just be prepared, my friends. I love y'all. I'm out. <laughs> We will be eating bugs. Tanner will be drinking beer and eating bugs. I will be eating a little bit. He will be eating a lot as he promised. So beer and bugs, be ready for that live and video coming soon.